this is going to be a video that should inspire you. You should walk away after watching this video and feel good about yourself. Every time I've walked into a classroom, you know, you have fresh faces, 30 students, some are better than others. They all have different backgrounds. But every single person on this earth has hidden potential. I've seen it. I have seen people do things that are just shocking, just admirable. You, you think, how, how could they recover from that? How could they claw their way back from such failure? And it's not because they were necessarily gifted. It's because most people on this earth are pretty good. You know, you know, barring any serious, you know, disabilities and things, most people have a lot of unlocked potential. That's, that's the cold, hard truth. And it's a positive thing. It's a good thing. So you ask then, why do these people fail? Why do people not succeed? And that's what I want to talk about in this video. There's, there's basically two things. There's two things. So the first one is belief. I think that a lot of people have a very big lack of belief in their abilities. They, they just don't believe that they can do it. You know, they, they look at a job and it might have some coding requirements and maybe they're thinking like, oh, I'm okay at Python and I kind of, I used Unix before and you know, they're scared. So they don't believe that they can learn on the job. They don't believe that they have the capability to do the job so they, so they don't act. You have to believe. You have to believe that you can do anything in this world because when you stop believing, when you stop having hope, that's when, that's when things get dark, my friends. You always have to believe that you can do anything in this world. You know, when you're a kid, you, you go to school, you know, like kindergarten, first grade. And I, I remember pre-kinder. I remember I had a girlfriend in pre-kinder. And I feel like kids believe that they can do anything. And then you get older and you start having fears and doubts. But the reality is that's just, that's just the world taking its toll on you. You need to go back to those times when you were young and you dreamed and you wanted to be anything. Maybe you wanted to be a fireman. Maybe you wanted to be, I wanted to be an archaeologist, you know. Believe that you can do anything. So you have to have belief. You have to have hope. And most people, they, they write it off as, well, that's not realistic. The word realistic is a word in the English language. And sure, there are certain things that are hard to do. Like if you want to be in the NBA, <laughs> Uh, that's going to be pretty hard, right? I mean, that's, that's you know, professional sports. That's one that's, but if you want to get a degree or if you want to get a job, if you want to have a good life, those are things you can do, right? Those are things you can do. So believe, start believing in yourself. That is, that is the number one thing you have to do is believe that you can do anything. It's hard to believe when you failed repeatedly, but the moment you stop believing is it's gone. You have to have hope. You have to have hope. The second thing, besides belief, is you need to stop, I'm going to put this in a negative way, lying to yourself. So most people tell themselves they're not ready yet. I'm not ready to start yet. You know, maybe, maybe you're just studying mathematics and you want to, let's say you want to study number theory. That's a really good example. You want to learn number theory. So number theory is a, is a math subject. And it's not too bad, but it does require that you know how to write proofs. So if you didn't know how to write proofs and you started working on number theory, you, you might have a hard time. So you might hesitate and you might never buy that number theory book. You might never start because you're waiting for those perfect conditions. And so people lie to themselves because they tell themselves they're not ready. So stop waiting for perfect conditions, because the truth is, the cold, hard truth, and it's a positive thing, is that perfect conditions will never come, right? It's, it's never going to be perfect. I have known so many 
incredibly brilliant people in my life. And they're smart and they're successful in their own ways. But when I look at them, I see potential. And a lot of times they don't realize their full potential because they fail to act. They fail to act because they wait for perfect conditions. And my friends, perfect conditions will never come. It's, it's never going to get here. So those two things, basically believe in yourself. So believe that you can do anything and stop waiting for the perfect moment. And when you do that, it does one thing that's very powerful. When you believe in yourself and you stop waiting for perfect conditions, that creates the one thing on this earth that you can do that can cause change in your life. It, it's so important that I wrote an entire book on this philosophy. It's action. Because my friends, action, taking action, after you watch this video, take action. Taking action is the only thing you can do in this world that's going to lead to results. You can sit here and you can go on Google, you can ask AI, you can watch videos. And yes, you should watch my videos. I want you to watch them, but action is more important, right? Taking action, 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 action. Think about it. You can sit here and you can think about your regrets. Like, oh, I should I should have studied harder for that test or, oh, you know, I should have asked that pretty girl out or, oh, I should have applied for that job or, oh, why'd I drop that class? Why'd I fail? Or you can sit here and dream about the future and plan, which is also fun. It's fun to plan. It's fun to dream. Or you can take action. And between those three things, my friends, only one of them is going to lead to results. Action. Think about it. If you want to get better at running, if you want to get in shape, you put the shoes on and you go for a run. If you want to get buff, you, you eat more and you lift weights. If you want to get better at math, you do mathematics, right? If you want to learn physics, you have to do physics. Action, action, action. If you want to get a college degree, you have to go to college. If you want to get a job, you have to apply. Action, action, action. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice. I'm getting over a cold. But I wanted to make this video because I was talking to a friend, um, I think the night before last, and she was telling me about one of her classmates and stuff. And it kind of led me to this thought. Believe in yourself. Stop waiting for the perfect moment. And when you do those two things, it's going to lead you to take action. Again, my friends, action is, is the one thing in this world that can change everything for you. It really can. Again, it's so important that I wrote an entire book on it. It's, I have a bunch of books, but it's the one that has the best reviews. You can look it up in the description on Amazon. Uh, it's called Real Superpowers That Will Change Your Life. And it's a book that inspires you to take action because that's all you can do in this world. And, and the thing with, with action, here, here's the hard thing. Here's why believing yourself is so, is so important. Many people, they fail to take action. Why? They don't believe in themselves. They think they're going to fail. They're afraid. They think that they're going to work hard. And there's no guarantees in life, right? There, there's no guarantees. There's this show. I used to, I used to love this show. It's called Law and Order. And it was the criminal intent series. And, um, the, the main guy, I forgot his name, Vincent something. He's, he's a quirky guy. Uh, he's talking to one of the criminals and the criminal says to him, oh, but I just work so hard and, and, and I couldn't do it. And he looks at him and he says, welcome to the human race. Welcome to the human race, my friends, right? You can work really, really hard, but you might not have results, but you have to believe because if you don't try, then you're never going to have results, right? You'll never know. And you don't want to live your life in regret. So start believing, stop waiting for the perfect moment and start taking action. I, I cannot emphasize that enough. And by, by taking action, I mean, do whatever it is you want to do, you know, if you want to get in shape, start getting in shape. If you want to learn mathematics, buy some courses, buy some books, watch some free videos on the internet, do math. Whatever it is you're trying to do with your life, take action. Even if it seems impossible, even if it seems like you're not going to be able to do it, because if you don't try, if you don't try, you'll never know. And when you're 90 years old, if you make it that far, you're going to look back. You'll be like, oh, I should have listened to that random person on the internet, the math source, or who was that idiot guy Tell me to take action. Take action. Take action. Let go of the fears. Let go of the insecurities, right? Take action. Stay strong, my friends.